After not one, but two devastations in Louisiana, Portsmouth-based Mercy Chefs are heading home after weeks of service. They traveled south, helping victims of Hurricane Ida last month. And Casey Baylor spoke with the organization about the challenges they faced. Mercy Chefs founder Gary LeBlanc says his teams are almost home after serving Hurricane Ida victims in Louisiana for two weeks. He says this trip brought back many emotions. To be back in Louisiana on the 16th anniversary of Katrina was, um, you know, it was a lot of triggers in that for me. LeBlanc started the organization after Hurricane Katrina hit Louisiana in 2005. He says the storm brought some unique challenges. Um, there was a lot of flooding a lot of wind damage, but the, the power outages in a major U.S. city uh, and then all the surrounding areas was very unique for us this time. Lack of power didn't stop volunteers from helping. They served more than 200,000 meals to hurricane victims in 17 different locations, hitting a record for the organization. We went past anything we had ever done before. As the power returned and many other businesses began to turn the lights on, he says it was time for Mercy Chefs to pack up. The organization served the last meal Wednesday night, but LeBlanc says their efforts aren't over. We're already watching additional storms out in the Atlantic, and uh, we, we have a little bit of a concern that we have not seen the worst of this hurricane season. In Portsmouth, Casey Baylor, 13 News Now. LeBlanc says that volunteers should return home tonight. He says this weekend volunteers will clean up their equipment to prepare for the next disaster.